place them at the front door, and then we will call them that the items are ready. Groceries and vitamins. Those are some of the items being delivered by a group of volunteers to people in self-quarantine. The family self-isolated themselves because they had a guest from Iran, and we are helping them to stay at home. For privacy reasons, we're not showing where this delivery is being made. Uh, my sister-in-law came uh, from Iran, so based on Canada Health uh, warning, we had to have them inside the home and not let them go outside. Also, because we were in contact with them, we decided to have inside the home for two weeks to make sure they are not spreading like the wires. The group called Keep Society Safe was created by the Tri-City Iranian Cultural Society this week. It came in response to the spread of COVID-19 and cases linked to travels to Iran. They're calling us and they, they order and uh, our volunteers buy it from the stores and uh, uh, drop it off by, uh, by the door and then they text it that, okay, your order is ready. While volunteers never come in direct contact with those living in isolation, they take precautions. So I'm just doing hand sanitizing my hands, um, even though I didn't touch anything, but just in case to make sure that I don't spread any virus to anyone else. The Cultural Society also set up an information session with a doctor before sending anyone door to door. We had a training for all volunteers. The group says since launching early this week, it's only had a handful of requests for deliveries, about four or five in the last few days. But what has been significant is the amount of people who have reached out to volunteer. Right now we have more than, I think, uh, 150 people are ready to help to us. The group says anyone in quarantine, regardless of background or recent travels, are invited to call the numbers posted on its website. It's good to take leadership role in the, in the community because we are living in this community. It's good to contribute to the health of society. Yeah, I, I really appreciate it. This is amazing. In Coquitlam, Isma Regem, City News.